What's going on, you guys? You know who it is. It's your favorite guy, Mr. Omar. I'm back at it again on this special Happy Friday. Uh, I was just into my local car shop, and I stumbled upon this uh, this Millennium 10. Yes, indeed. It is some definitely, definitely good things in this 10 that we definitely been anticipating for a good little minute. Now, Neither much to say. Uh, I really enjoy this tin. It's been a lot of anticipation for us, this tin. We got the likes of uh, DPE. We got King Dragoon, Red Eyes Dragoon Dragon. Uh, we got a lot of reprints that's definitely been needed. We have Forbidden Droplets that's in this tin, and so forth and so on. So uh, I'm going to enlighten you with this uh, tin opening. We're going to see what's going on. So let's get ready to kick it. Uh, it's going to be a beautiful thing, a lovely thing. Also, I want to give a special shout out to my favorite places. We're going to give a shout out to TCG Player. On the other hand, we're going to give another shout out. We're going to give a shout out to Yu-Gi-Oh! Mint. And then, last but not least, we're going to give a shout out to Droning Tone. So, those are some of my favorite websites that I love to get my singles from. A beautiful thing, a lovely thing. I want y'all to stay tuned because we're going to go in depth in this tin. So y'all stay tuned. Let's see what we're going to do. I'm going to get ready to open up the tin. Let's see. I always like to open from the bottom up so we don't damage the tin. My nifty box cutter. Oh, look at that. Also, what I love about this tin, it has all three of the Egyptian God cards. So you see Ovilus the Tormentor, you see the Winged Dragon of Raw, and also you see Slyther. So we're going to get ready to bust this open. We're going to see what's inside of it. So here we go. Three packs. Uh, out of these three packs, uh, I'm not sure how many cards in them, but we are looking for some Prismatic, looking for some Hollow Falls, and we also looking for the big cards that's in it. So, with further ado, we're about to get ready to bust these open. All three packs. Now I have to say we've been waiting for these this set to come out for a good little minute, these reprints. So we're about to get ready to get into it. Let's find out in pack number one. Oh. opening. We have. Let's, let's keep it in order. We have Magic Key. Beatles is a different archetype. I've never tried it, but the downgrade is actually pretty decent. They're uh, a pretty decent set, pretty decent archetype. Gold keys finishing move. Hmm. It's our first hollow fool. Looks like we got an evil twin. Second hollow fool. Hmm. Ah, so you get three hollow fools. 
Surf Champ. DDD Assailant Carrier. Not bad. Okay, we got the Prismatic Rail right here. ZS for our Utopia players. Not bad at all. I have to say I'm pretty much impressed with this. Now, let's see how many was in here. Eighteen cards. Not bad. Pretty good ratio. So out of that we got a rare. Three hollow fools. Two supers and a prismatic. Oh hey, I can't complain. That's pretty good out the first pick. Come on, we need to pull King Dragoon or Droplets. That would really make me happy. Or DP, Prismatic. So that was out of our first. Now I'm about to open up pack number two. Let's see. If you smile for us again, let's see. We got the Tri Brigade. Let's see. Hmm. Arm Dragon Lightning. Pretty good archetype. Link Apple. Feel it. Come on, smile upon me. Okay, our first rare. Judge of the Ice Beard. Not too bad. Okay. We got the hand trap. Hmm. I will be going on my TCG affiliates and then I'm gonna be seeing how much these cards are priced, but this is a nice pool right here. Nice pool. He's king. Okay, we got the Arm Dragon. Level 10. Man, either. I was kind of shocked to see the upgrade rarity bump of this card, but hey. Here's what it is. We gotta be careful because flip effects can definitely come back. So hey, we gotta definitely keep our eyes out on this. Oh my goodness. Oh Pot of Prosperity reprint. Prismatic. Now I didn't expect this one. This is an expensive ticket. Uh the last time this card was well, roughly about a hundred plus, probably between the price range of eighty to ninety dollars. But once I check into that, uh, I'm definitely, definitely got my money's worth on this. Part of prosperity, fantastic. Fable. Okay, they showing some support for our magic keys. Hey, I can appreciate this deck. I run this deck, and it's a pretty fire deck. 
I'm surprised that you know the bump rarity, but like I say, with instant fusion, you can pay a thousand, bring it out, go into a synchro. It's pretty a uh, win-win situation. On top of that, with me running pure Magic Keys, and this car goes to the grave, well, when it's summer, I can add the Magic Key map to your back to my hand. So it's a good thing, you know, keep recycling. I'm telling you, I don't sleep on Magic Keys now. When you need a little bit more support, about that much more support, I'm devastated. Branded, okay, the quick play spell. Talking about a Spriggins player. <laughs> Trooper. Now I have to say I'm 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 highly impressed with what we got. So our rare was the judge of the ice berry. Then a rare pile. You got the moon ghost. And you can't go with the oh, Look at that pretty cool. So shiny. You got the beast king. For our two supers. And the dragon. And then the mini bug. Once again, so surprised. Pot of press mm -mm -mm. Definitely smiled against me. Okay. Now we're about to get ready to dig. Last and final pack. Maybe they'll smile upon me. Maybe, maybe not. But we're not sure. But we're going to give it another go around. Like I said, it's your guy, Mr. Omar. Like, share, subscribe, you know. Leave a comment. You know, I'm always hit back. Uh, what I'm going to start doing, I'm going to start doing a little bit more on the channel. Uh, if I get 20 comments, I'm going to start raffling off a 10. Leave your name, your information. And once I do the raffle, I'll mail you a 10. So, hey, thank you for showing me love. I'm going to show it back to the Yu Gi Oh! community. So, let me think about it. Let's see. Let's pack. Let's see what we do. I like the way I do that. And most people just tear them all over the crumble. I'm gonna just keep tear from the back. You gotta do all that. Tear from the back. Open. There you go. You gotta rip and just tear the car to shreds. And I do collect the packs. I might have to go back to my old school ways. Just don't even open the pack, just put it in the binder. <laughs> I'll be like, that's probably what it is. Now let's see. Let's see what we're doing. Okay, we're gonna see. Got the sushi ship, okay. Zexel. Ice J, that's for you Ice Bear players. Flunderies. Now this is a pretty good deck. I did my uh, profile at Dabber's Gaming Carbon Car Shop in uh, Georgia. It was pretty good. My guy went first place undefeated. Psychic Eraser. This used to be a hard, hollow floor, they knocked it down to a common. Okay, another hand trap. Hmm. Spooky moon, okay, okay. Like I said, this is this is what it's all about, those good pools. I can truly say I'm very impressed. We got the Ice Jade. Got the Mister. For those Mister players. The 
They got dual tower, okay. Everybody been looking for this. I can pretty much say I'm, I'm impressed with my pools. It's definitely been good. Like I say, I done made my purchase off the tin can back 20% with the product prosperity. Branded in white. Oh. Gizmic. Magic key, I love this card. I need to show my deck some more support. Please, hold on. So, out of these three packs, I'm very impressed. Very, very impressed. I can't complain. The pools were definitely phenomenal. For two hand traps, I can't complain at all. Two supers, and also the three prismatic. So I can truly say I'm very impressed with the product. I'm very impressed with the team. Uh, I went to my local car shop, purchased it for $21 for tax, and it was worth it. I pulled two prismatics that I didn't double my profit just by purchasing the team, and I can truly say I'm very impressed with what's going on here. Now we're going to do a small little recap, let you see what I've got. Uh, like I say, at the end of the day, I love Yu-Gi-Oh. I love the products that they present to us. Uh, we reshaping the metal. We still haven't got that band list yet, so uh, it's getting ready to come up. So I'm just trying to see how it's going to shape before I start tweaking, start doing more stuff with the decks. Uh, more deck profiles is going to come. Uh, hopefully, I think in the next week or so, if I can ever get my Monday or my Thursday back, I will be taking y'all to my local shops. We got daggers. We got room condition. Got yeah, gigabytes on Sunday, so hey, I got a lot of new deck profiles, a lot of new prospects to show you for the channel. So I just definitely want you to stay tuned. Now we're gonna get ready to recap. So yeah, I had a pretty nice pool. Those on my rear. I'm gonna go to my supers. Like I said, I'm very impressed with my pool. I didn't think I was gonna pull that new. Yes, indeed, part of prosperity. Beautiful, Yugi, isn't it beautiful? So, once again, it's your guy, Mr. Omar. I just want to thank you for coming in and letting me download the new 10 Candles to your system. Once again, I'm very impressed. Uh, definitely love this product. I'm uh, definitely, definitely, definitely enjoying it. So, once again, y'all enjoy. Thank you for letting me download into your system. You know who it is. Your favorite guy, Mr. Omar. Like, share, subscribe. Hit me up. Let me know what you think. And I'm going to definitely hit you back up. Y'all stay be blessed. You know who it is. It's your favorite guy, Mr. Omar. Peace.